so today we're going to be reacting to Scary Compilations version 6. Uh, I've not watched version 1 or 2 or 3 or 4 or 5, but that's one had the most views. So I'm just going to get into it. In the middle of the night, Danny Donahue woke up to a noise that came from his bathroom. Here's what he caught on camera. He's not even just turn the light on. It's a fucking messy bathroom anyway. <laughs> okay. Just don't open it, just walk away. Just turn the light on. Good, there we go. That didn't really help much. Just jump in, just jump in, just punch. There's gonna be nothing there, just punch. Start punch, just run punches. <laughs> You better do a Mike Tyson and just start eating the fucking ghost ear off. I like how the first thing they do is start recording. They don't phone a friend or phone the police, they just start recording. No, nope. Although obviously fake, it sure is pretty damn scary. But just imagine how terrifying it would be to encounter something like this in real life. Surely, those who are faint-hearted would not even dare to imagine themselves in a situation like this. Oh, just fucking throw. Sean just Shutt and his friends were camping when, These while shires. sleeping inside a tent, they captured this. What is that? Yo, what the f*** is that? That one's already pushed himself. Creepy. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm sleeping in the car tonight. <laughs> it's so it's spirits, man. <laughs> oh, we're in the fucking we're in the woods. I mean, what's the bit? It's just someone with a fucking pot and pan and just grating cheese at the same time. It's pretty much someone just making macaroni and they're getting scared. Not sleeping the night. <laughs> 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 they stack. <laughs> How many did they got there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wow. That ain't bad. I'm not going camping again. It sure is a mystery as to what was outside Sorry. making those noises. One thing is for sure though, they're not going to go camping ever again, or at least at this spot. Vivian Ispitia had recently lost her cat from being run over by a car. She was in total shock after seeing her cat lying lifeless on the street. However, this wasn't as shocking as what she saw in the footage <clears throat> from the surveillance camera outside her home, which recorded the incident. Have a look at the footage and see if you notice anything unusual. Right. Got a cat strolling down the road. A tree. That same cat, huh? Nah, bro, the cat got ran over a fart, just slipped out of his ass, and that was his spirit leaving. Look at it go. <laughs> Definitely a fart. If Bibian claims that her cat was dead and killed upon impact from being hit by a car, then what was this? A fart. When the car went over the cat, it just flattened it and it ass just spit it ass. Camera in her living room. <laughs> Tiffany Lala sees something pretty creepy. The child you see in this footage is Tiffany's son, but she can't wrap her head around this footage, as she doesn't know why her son looks semi-transparent. Tiffany doesn't know what to make of this. However, many viewers have commented that her son might be astral projecting. Astral projection is the ability to have an out-of-body experience on command. 
The ability to induce an out-of-body experience allows one's consciousness or soul to travel outside of its physical body. I, I get that when someone's um although very cool. Astral projecting could be dangerous. Those who've tried this have encountered unsettling things. From stories of people who've experienced unusual sensations, some of which have made people wake up in a cold sweat, to seeing things that are truly terrifying. It's probably best to do some research on knowing how to safely astral project before trying it out. Whether or not Tiffany captured actual footage of her son astral projecting is up for debate but we can all agree that the footage alone is pretty creepy. Bets and Angel lives across from the woods and has been seeing something strange within them. Um, this is the area where we see that figure. It just walks back and forth every day, all day. Now, I've been over there a couple of times um, as I walk up on it. There's just nothing there. Um, yesterday I went, sir, sir. yesterday was Easter, sure, 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 there, but again. two big dogs that were off leash came out and oh, sure, 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 sure. it was time to go. Then we had the storm, so as soon as we're done with our schoolwork, I will record myself going across the street and show you that as you walk over, you no longer see what appears to be a person pacing back and forth for just hours clearly hours is and days i think today's like day five so she's been seeing this figure for the past few days and it's been doing the same thing each day walking back and forth for hours on end bets and angel has no idea as to what this person is doing however a few days later she decides to head over to the woods to figure out what's going on as she walks over with her husband she records this The spot. I don't see anything. No, I don't. I don't fucking gun gun. It's just pretty cool. full. Hello? Hey, it's just just gonna gonna Is anybody there? I'm, I'm right, here, right here. I'm so nervous. What was that? I don't know. Do you need help? Looks like a, like a, like a, like a skill skill in between the trees. trees. It sounds as though someone is yelling run. 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 No, no. This may have been directed Ugh. towards her and her husband as a warning. Had they walked any further, this individual could have harmed them. It isn't clear as to whether or not she called the police. But one thing I'm sure of is that she'll Dude, definitely she stay away from the going. spot. Anyway, I guess that was pretty creepy. Um, might do a part two to this, I'm not too sure. I know it's not the longest videos, but be, if I keep doing videos like this, then there will be more consistent. But there won't be as long, but there'll be more. Uh, anyway, if you like this type of reaction to Skate or anything you want me to react to, just leave it in the comments uh, and I'll react to it. But, peace.